So uh, recently, many of you guys keep asking me whether WhatsApp is still working on the BlackBerry Classic or not, how to use it, so on. Well, you ask it, you shall receive it. You come to the right place. So in order to make the WhatsApp workable uh, on the BlackBerry Classic, this is the only way. I try different web browser like Kiwi browser, Opera Mini, the default BlackBerry browser is not working. It turns out Google Chrome is the only web browser that you can use your WhatsApp web. All right. The WhatsApp apps is not working anymore. So that's why the website version is the only way to go. The Google Chrome version here is super obsolete because the latest Google Chrome version only supports Android 8.0. So minimum requirement for Android is Android 8.0. And this BlackBerry Classic and the rest of the BlackBerry OS 10 only supports uh, Android 4.3 runtime. It's not safe. Yeah, the privacy concern here is something that you need to take note. But if you really want to use WhatsApp on a BlackBerry Classic or BlackBerry Passport, other BlackBerry OS 10 devices, this is the only way to go. Use it with cautious. If you don't know how to install this, sideload the Android apps. Uh, I already have a video that teach you guys how to do it. A tutorial video, just click that link and the uh, APK of this Google Chrome, I will put the link down below so you guys can go uh, install it, all right? Download and install it. So let's open it. I hope that you won't crash. All right, no. Yep. So right now, what you need to do is go to the WhatsApp web. Yeah, it's gonna take some time. Be patient. WhatsApp. Okay, WhatsApp what? So right now you need to request for desktop site. Finally show up the QR code. It took me some time. God knows how long I waited. Link a device. Let me unlock it. Okay. Okay. Login. Oh. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. So on my phone, it shows Google Chrome Linux, which means uh, login successfully. And the website is still waiting, still loading. Just, you need to be patient using the BlackBerry Classic. Uh, the Passport will be definitely faster because of the faster processor. This is uh, using a much slower processor. Okay, finally, finally, as you can see, finally you can use WhatsApp on your BlackBerry Classic. But then uh, the feature you can use it on the WhatsApp web is very limited. You cannot call someone, you cannot video call you cannot audio call nothing you just can texting and that's it you know the basic yeah you, know, you can type a message here super small yeah just hi hi okay so i type hi yeah, it work, it's working right now. As you can see, it give you the, this magnifier because the whole UI is so small. If you want to change some setting, there's a setting icon here and you can log out. If you want, you can change the teams or anything, chat, yeah, the teams. You can make it to dark. I always use dark team. Okay. The whole thing is dark. Yeah, you can change the uh, chat wallpaper. Yeah, I'm just going to use the default. Uh, maybe black. Yes, I want to use black. Black Pro. And that's it. That's how you change some of the uh, WhatsApp setting here. 
this is the only way it's not the perfect way uh i don't know why you guys want to use whatsapp on your blackberry classic it's a bit inconvenient to be honest and the security concern privacy concern uh, is something that you need to take note once again because the google chrome apps is so obsolete this version of Google Chrome is back in 2018. I don't recommend you guys to do it, but if you really want to do it, this is the only way, once again. So thanks for watching. Remember to click a thumbs up, subscribe, comment down in the comment section below. Share this video to your friends and family. And I will see you in the next video, guys. Goodbye.